In RECOM, you and your wider global network of researchers gather and assess the best evidence on the impact of foreign aid. Here we look at how aid works in relation to the environment and climate change. Foreign aid has always had a role in addressing environmental issues and in helping with natural disasters. But today, the environment is facing a very different challenge. A challenge of threatening dimensions. Climate change is transforming our planet. A minimum increase of 2 degrees centigrade in surface temperatures is built into the climatic system and cannot be negated. This could have devastating effects on human welfare and the environment, especially for some of the poorest countries which are being disproportionately affected by climate change. The three goals – development, climate change adaptation and climate change mitigation are, in reality, inseparable policy areas. What role is there for development aid in addressing these goals? Foreign aid is already helping people and countries to strengthen their capacities to adapt to climate change. Aid is traditionally aimed towards poor countries, but the economic and social transformations required to achieve global environmental sustainability are truly profound. Although environmental concerns are to some extent integrated into foreign aid, we see two main problems. Environmental aid is becoming increasingly fragmented. Aid directed towards environmental issues is increasing, while at the same time the share of environmental aid delivered through bilateral channels is growing. And this causes aid to be less capable of dealing with challenges of global proportions. There is debate on whether to shift aid from fast-growing middle-income countries to lower-income countries. Although the vast majority of the world's 1.3 billion poor actually live in the middle-income economies. However, since their production and resource consumption is intensifying, leaving the middle-income countries out of the equation will not help address this global problem. Foreign aid cannot work alone. You and your wider researchers discuss what works, what could work, what is scalable, and what is transferable in foreign aid. Aid has the potential to be an important catalyst in finding solutions to adapt to and mitigate the effects of our changing environment. To learn more, come visit our website at recom.wider.unu.edu.